Whoa-ho-ho-ho, howdy. Hello, hello, and welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my first stream in a while again. Um, sorry about the wait on that. Um, there is um, an ulterior reason for the stream... Um, that um today uh other than just uh playing playing killer is dead which i will get to uh the game specifically in a second um but the um but there's a couple of reasons one of them is that um i just got a new mic um and i've been kind of playing around with it i'm just trying to make sure i get the levels all sounding good and uh balanced with the games and uh the mixer so i got the I got the new mixer got the new uh mic um i got um a new um a new sort of audio interface that allows uh analog uh analog mixers to uh interface with uh pc so it's kind of a converter. Um, and so I've had to, um, not to mention, um, I did get a bunch of stuff for Christmas to update my uh, PC, which uh, was a massive boost to uh, my overall uh, PC's power, which is actually really nice. I went from a, a solid quad-core processor, which did its job for a long time, to a six core uh with uh hyper threading so 12 logical cores uh six physical cores at uh almost four gigs um i think it's 3.9 um but anyway um so yeah significant upgrade and um new RAM, which, I mean, I've been running DDR3 RAM for a long, long time, and not really great DDR3 RAM either, so now I've moved up to DDR4, and it's at uh, 3,000 megs, so, um, so yeah, pretty sweet, um, and then on top of that, like I said, new mic, new, um, new mixer, um, new, uh, Actually, new streaming software. Uh, there's a lot of stuff I've been kind of trying to get used to. So, this game was kind of intended to be used as um, a kind of number one as a test run. Because uh, despite the fact that I absolutely love this game uh, and this was a good excuse to restart it, um, this wasn't exactly priority number one. I still need to. Um, get back to uh <laughs> um what's it called um shadow of the colossus and i also need to get back to um castlevania which by the way um either at the end of this video or um depending on what happens at the end of this video or at the end of uh the next video i plan on doing a sort of um sort of um not really a uh not really like a vote like a like holding a vote but just sort of a um sort of a question to be asked for, of anyone watching the streams um what game they'd like to see me continue the most uh out of the ones i've been playing because i've um the the three main ones that I could go back to, which you could count it as four, but I'll just say it is three at this point, um, are, um, Shadow of the Colossus, um, Castlevania, uh, Rondo of Blood, then there's, uh, Bloodborne, and, um, uh, Dark Souls Remastered. Uh, Dark Souls Remastered, like I said, kind of questionable, I didn't play that far into it, had some technical difficulties and to top it off i've been playing it a decent amount um since it came out um 
and off camera. The good news is it's mostly been done for the purposes of grinding and grabbing a few um, like sort of important items that I really wanted to get early on, as well as uh, defeating early bosses that aren't really really important bosses. They just kind of are like roadblocks to get to where you need to go. Um, so um, you could t toss Dark Souls in there, but by comparison, uh, Bloodborne, I had, uh, you know, I had way more time invested and I was getting uh, a large, that's probably my longest um, playthrough I've done so far. Well, I say playthrough, longest uh, Let's Play I've done so far. And um, I haven't finished any of them, which is sad, I know. But I've looked at them more, for the most part, a lot of times, uh, like with Hand of Fate um, and things like that that I've done in the past, more as just um, kind of uh, uh, preview videos or first impressions videos or things like that so people get an idea of uh, of what kind of game it is, what it's like, what the mechanics are how the gameplay is etc so i don't really feel too bad about a lot of them except for the ones that um i did kind of explicitly go out of my way to say yeah i really want to continue playing this game on stream and those were the ones that were the biggest so um so anyway um i didn't really want to use this as a uh let's or i didn't really want to use this stream as a um continuation of any of those because of like i said number one change in a lot of hardware and such and um the other reason is um something i'll say now but wait till the end of the stream to kind of bring it up uh in detail but i have an announcement that i'm going to uh, be discussing a little bit um, so, um, anyway, let's get on to Killer is Dead. Those are, uh, that's the, the pre uh, prelude, or preface. Uh, now let's get on to Killer is Dead. This game, um, awesome game. Amazing game, super fun. It's by, um, the writer slash director, Suda51. To those of you unfamiliar with his work, Suda51 is... A uh, very, very awesome, awesome designer. Um, when you look at his games, you can kind of automatically tell, like by style, that yeah, that's a Suda Fifty One game. It's like uh, it, it, very signature style. Um, can tell by the thumbnail there of the uh, game's protagonist. Um, I think his name is Mondo Zappa. Um, but yeah, very extravagant very uh almost um uh what's the word um abstract almost in a lot of ways very very unusual um storytelling elements characters um uh it's all very wild and super stylish but at the same time there is uh at the core of it like a a sort of uh, deep and epic story. You just got to kind of unpackage it and also expect that there's going to be a lot of sort of um, unusual humor involved. There's going to be a lot of very off the wall kind of characters. Um, and it's, it's always a really wild ride, but gameplay is solid. Storytelling is great. And, uh, killer is dead. I think is, is one of his best works. Um, recently, um, uh, killer seven came out on uh PC. Finally, um, that game was released a long time ago. I think on, on PS two or was it three? I can't remember for sure, but I do know that, um, it's been a long time since that game came out and it never came out on PC. A lot of people really like that game. It's a re really big cult hit. Um, doesn't have a lot of reach. It's not super popular, but it has a very devoted cult following and killer is dead is the same way, but 
in my opinion, um, although I think the um, the sort of storyline of Killer Seven is kind of a little bit more interesting um, and definitely more like. I don't want to say easy to follow because it's not really exactly easy to follow, but it definitely has more elements where it's where the strings and the dots kind of connect together a little bit easier. But uh, but in Killer Is Dead, um, there is uh, as far as the gameplay, I would say is a lot more engaging, a lot more exciting, in my opinion. Um, it's all really down to preference. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if someone said the opposite um, about both aspects. But um, that's the thing about Suda51's games is they're all very unique, interesting experiences that have a lot of um, a lot of very specific elements that are appealing to people for maybe totally different reasons. But at the same time, I think the core elements are all things that people can really appreciate. Uh, like I said, especially when it comes to art style and character progression, character design, um, world, uh, world design, world history, lore, all those things are all really strong and really interesting and make Suda 51 a very interesting designer in today's modern landscape. So, Anyway, sorry for the long introduction, um, but let's go ahead and get this game started. Now, um, you're only allowed one save. I have played a good chunk of this game, um, but <laughs> I didn't actually finish it. So, um, and since it was saved to Steam Cloud, which not all games are, as I've talked about before, this one was saved to Steam Cloud. My progress was saved. Um... But since you're not allowed more than one save, um, you don't get the option to, uh, oh, and Deep Silver, of course, awesome, awesome publisher. Um, hang on just a second. Let me, uh, have to adjust this real quick. All right, there we go. Now we're good. Okay, so here we go. Let me see, let me turn the volume down here and see if that, the balance is uh, a little tough. Let me turn the I think I could do to yeah that's much better um man this new mic is um I'm noticing um there's very little if any background noise coming through it's really nice um this was a uh this was another Christmas gift by the way of a uh, very awesome mic I'll show you guys more in detail when I have a cam on at some point, but uh, this AKG P220, uh, extra large diaphragm uh, condenser mic. It is awesome. Sounds great. Um, so, uh, where was that going? Oh, yeah, audio, audio. There we go. Okay. Should be better. All right, so let's start a new game. Man, this is hard. Okay, let's go ahead and do it. We'll go ahead and normal. I really, I don't remember at all what was happening on top of the fact that, um, that it's uh, a new playthrough. I um, 
I don't remember at all what was going on. So it's also kind of for me as far as that aspect goes too, but This game in a lot of ways is also kind of reminiscent of Cowboy Bebop. Um, you'll see what I mean when we get to the... Uh, get to the uh, sort of exposition storytelling, but... Um, and the fact that everything is handled in episodic format. But. Dumpsters have a large sort of, uh, I don't want to call it hitbox, but, uh, Hold, get your ass back. Checkmate. Dirty bastard. Oh yeah, bitch. That's right, bitch. Man, I love the visuals in this game. They're so good. It's like a brain dead mission where you don't have to do anything and you still still get the paycheck at the end. I love it. All right. 
get this show on the road. Oh yeah, by the way, Mondo is a uh, ladies man extraordinaire, by the way. <笑>少し待ってくれませんか今立てたんだよ時間だもんだごめん続きはこの後にしよう仕事を終えてからもう無理すぐだってすぐに終わる仕事だ終わったら部屋に行こうなんだいいわだったら許す<笑> He's got that James Bond sort of thing. Let's go! Mondo, he's on the ground. He's on the ground. He's on the ground. He's Now he's got his metal arm, now everything's good. Okay. I forgot all about that. Way to lock on. I know there is. I... But I actually haven't... Hang on a second. Oh, I don't even have enough for the first one. Let's see if I can just see the control scheme. Yeah, so I can't even dodge yet because it's... Okay, well, I'm sure the tutorials will pop up as I move forward. Wait, is this the way I'm supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go? This way? I guess so. Go again.
見事だな新入りが Oh shit He's got my、uh, secretary スーツにワインをこぼしやがった<笑>私はあなたの後継者ですそうかじゃあ俺はしくじったのかな念入りに忠実に職務を全うしてきたつもりだ、oh, that's right. 違うかブライアン所長はここにはいませんテーブルでお待ちですあなたと話がしたいとそうかならよかったよ I forgot they actually, uh... 頑張れよ CD 君もいつか同じ運命をたどるかもしれない Actually show you getting high 闇と向き合うことだ闇に包まれない光を探しなさいありがとうございます先人の言葉忘れませんうん。闇を飲み込んだのか食ってやったさ<笑>全部な俺は闇に魅了されてしまった美しくも不死だらない闇よに誰しもその危険性はあるいいさしかしあの新入りは危ういだからお前が導いてやれよああそのつもりだショケに,に乾杯乾杯いいワインだ He came all this way with a slit throat. <laughs> Much more slit than that. Jinse was sweet at the sea. So, Kurosino Jiganda. Yeah, sounds good to me. <laughs> Man, only a B? How do I get a B on that? <laughs> I guess it's probably time.、It、took me a while to figure everything out. Okay.、Um, I'm guessing nothing. Yeah. 
There's some um, unusual side missions that get unlocked, but and, and it happens very early on, like to the point that you're nowhere near the level you would need to be to actually pull it off, but they open them up anyway, so... Oh yeah, this is how you get your, uh, <laughs> this is how you get your contracts. Okirumiko, <laughs>落ちるなら一人でやってくれ。こっちはこれから仕事だ。次頑張ればいい。俺が助手で雇ってやる。本当ですか？だから一刻も早く準備だ。急げ。頑張ります。おはようございます。モンドです。今日からお世話になります。<
一週間をお待たせすることはありませんよろしくお願いしますあらいタイムとゲットダウンとビジネススゲームはフェアリースローシュートヒメモキコイナカンセナジュータクノイですねでも確かに臭いわね刺激臭これは不臭ですねで大丈夫大丈夫です,ですやばくなったらいつでも呼びなさい速攻でヘルプするからねありがとうございます依頼はキラーイズデッド I just realized something too I forgot when you're on the world map you can access the、uh, ターゲットはどこかしら the office for upgrades and things hang on a second Yeah, you know what? I better go back to the office and.、Um, I could just skip the cutscene because、um, the yellow crystals you get to upgrade.、Um, you can buy them、uh, from the gift shop. <laughs> Oh, bad, nearly enough. <laughs> hmm. Man, I thought there was another option for that. I guess I was wrong. Well, that was a waste of time. Because I already have three Mika tickets, which is basically kind of like a、uh, revival item. This is for、uh, some of the mini games you can play later on.、Um, and I don't have enough for anything else. So. Oh well. Alright. Skip. So I really want to unlock some.、Uh, Upgrades because that、um, that robotic arm is the main the main tool you get to use. You turn into a gun, you can turn into a drill,、um, you turn into all kinds of fun little things. Not to mention the abilities you get with、uh, just physical abilities. Ah, here's a interesting character. Nice. So, those are some of the things that pop up on the world map.、Uh, the challenges.、Um, 
男の人助けてください君は姉を助けてください姉は壊れてしまいました I think this is the Alice in Wonderland、um, themed mission Yeah アリスを助けてくださいアリスはどこにいるんだいアリスは怖い男の人に騙されただから怖いんです信用してほしい僕の名前はモンド君の名前はアリサですオッケー Yes, as you can see, very, very. すぐって言ったじゃないいつまで待たせるの仕事なんてやめて早く来て<笑>あなたへのプレゼントがあるの<笑> Oh OK, I'll go this way Ah, 仕事中のトラブルは刀で解決なさい<音声>この程度の攻撃防ぐのも増さないわね、oh, that's right. Oh, there's dodge. Okay. I was gonna say. Don't give me block and not dodge. Here we go. Now we're getting to all of, all of our tutorials. Presence. Ah, here we go. Oh, Whoa, hey there. That's right. Time dodge is how you get that off. Oh, yeah, that's right. Sweet. Ooh, there we go. I have enough finally to get an upgrade of some sort. Okay. Now. Skill attack or the、uh, increased dash speed. Let's see what this.、Uh... Oh, I actually remember this attack. I really like it. 
And the next one after that is this one, which is also really, really nice. Um, what are these? This is, yeah, this one is very important. Oh, but you have to get bullet shot first, so I guess... Well, in any case, I'm getting this one for sure. Oh, and that's right, you can get multiple levels of each, so... Yeah, that's how we do. Sweet. Alright. Alright, here you go. Here's your flowers. <laughs> What are you doing here? I get a feeling this isn't really you. Or maybe it is. What the hell are you doing? Heh. <laughs> Mika! Omae, do kara hai tanda? Senpai! Ano, ano, ano! Kono lamp to te mo fushigi na no da! でも決しても<笑> There we go. Oh yeah, you gotta turn them all off if I remember correctly. Okay, hang on a second here. Yeah, you gotta turn them all off. I think there's one four. Turn. There we go. Now, actually, when you run out of blood, you can still shoot the weapon, but it just is really slow. Gotta wait a long time in between each shot, whereas when you have blood, it's rapid fire, so... Now Mika's gone. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. I didn't actually know that. But that's cool. Stairs are in place. Yeah, I've already done that, but let's see if I have enough to do something else. Oh, uh, I don't think so. Nope, not quite.
I don't remember exactly the details of this, so I'm not gonna say anything because I could be right. お姉さんを心配していましたよ。嘘よ。そう、嘘ですね。この家にはあなたの匂いが染み付いている。あなた一色だ。僕はもうあなたに会っている。モンドさん。ありがとう。ここまで来てくれた男の人は最初で最後
That's right, you gotta hack off all the limbs. Okay, there's side two. Oh, and there we go. There's our main target, I'm guessing. Oh, that's right. Then these bastards. Okay, Mika. Mondo, Mondo. There's supposed to be a skill that you get. I don't remember when you get it, but it lets you convert your um, your blood into health. And I thought that was a standard ability that you just had, but I guess not, because... You little bastards are... You've done way more damage than she has. What is this? Has... Damn it. I can't see them, so I can't see when I'm supposed to dodge or block or anything. No, you fucking asshole. Damn it. Stay moving, I guess. There we go. All right, asshole. Let's see how you like this one now. How you like me now? Had to waste had to waste one of my fucking Mika tickets on you, you bitch. Kawaii so na 
ジの家でゆっくり眠ってね作業完了しましたご苦労さん初陣にしちゃ上出来だ<笑>こちらがご依頼の品になりますありがとうございます<笑>アリスやっと会えたね<笑>やっぱり君だったんだねあのお知り合いだったのでしょうか<笑>、ええ、僕を殺した女です What the hell? This is what I'm talking about with、uh, Suda 51, man. His、uh... Oh, so he was the one that was Maybe she was, but her story about the moon is definitely true. Doing myself any favors with these low scores. Ah, well. The, the Gigolo Challenge missions are fucking crazy. <laughs> There's that one, episode 51. Which I'm guessing, you know, not to make it sound too obvious, is Suda 51's episode, but. <laughs>、uh, episode 4, that's The Man Who Stole the Moon.、Um, that is a very important episode.、Um, I think I'll go ahead and at least play that one, and then I'll、uh, call it quits for today, but.、Um, See what I can afford now. Still not enough for much. I'm gonna go ahead. Why does it say I have three? When I. Hmm. I thought I used one. Oh well. Now, let me see something status and upgrades. That's the ability. I need 70, uh. I need 70 to, uh. shards to get it. Man. God, that is such a useful ability. In fact, I'm gonna save up those fucking things 
ASAP for that ability because it's really, really, really important. Anyway. Yeah, this is the mission where you have to uh, go after David. この世に残した。私の体だけをこの世に残した。私たちは過去の統治者であり、支配者であった。この世界を浄化することは簡単だが、それは望んでいなかった。この星の美しさが好きだった。月から見える地球は私たちの命だった。全てを奪った密漁者
さあ楽しんでくれ思った通り大したことないな。I'm not sure what those purple spheres are, but uh... That way, yet because I'm thinking that. Oh, wait, this is. Make sure, just in case there's any items that will help me level up or something. Oh, whoops. The other way was the way. Could have gone for the uh, super kill on that, but oh well. I keep pushing that to block, and I'm not sure what. <laughs> Was it 70 or was it 75? It was 70. Sweet. All right. Nice. Oh, man. That's a... Uh, that is a big bonus. In fact, I'm going to utilize it right now. There we go. That's such a big help, I swear. You have no idea. Of course, you get improvements to it so that it makes it worth uh, um, less roses to... There they are again. What are those? Oh, I need the drill. Shit. Well, do I get the drill from... Oh, no. I get the drill, um... Through the story, because I can't... Huh. Damn. Maybe I get on this stage? That'd be cool. 
can't remember when I get the drill, but... Haha! <laughs> oh wait, what's this way? No! Well, I need to go the other way first. <laughs> Can I restart the last checkpoint? Yeah, okay. Let me see where that goes. Oh my god, the whole mission? <laughs> the checkpoint is the whole mission? Oh well, I'm doing it over again, I guess. Yo, what's up, Predator? I didn't see you come in, man. I'm doing alright, how you doing? Do I still have my upgrades or did I lose them all? Yeah, I lost them all. Son of a bitch. Oh well. I know I will get enough very soon. And eh, come on. Let's get this going. So, Tanoshinde. There's those damn things. And there's not much else I can get. Some healing somewhere. Health leveled up. Cool, man. Um, I'll probably be down to do some paladins a little bit later. I can't say for sure because um, I don't know how late I'll be up today, but um, but I'll try to make it on because uh, I've been meaning to for the last couple of days. I just haven't been just haven't been able to stay awake and be ready to play. And I have not wanted to pass out again in the middle of a session, so... <laughs> yeah. Okay, so there's nothing on that porch for me. Let's just get this one. There we go! Blood level up. Sweet. Man, I'm nailing it with those. Mondo. Sweet. All right. There we go. That's an upgrade, and I can get that. Okay, sweet. <laughs> okay, now I'm pretty much back where I was. Another health level up, sweet. Okay. 
I would love, love that. Double check, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> okay. This has to be some kind of secret room, so... Because it's hidden in a vase that was... Aha! Here we go. I'm glad I came back. <laughs> Yeah, this was actually worth restarting the level because I don't want to miss those. You can always replay the missions, but I mean, obviously it's much better to catch them the first time around, but... Oh, that sucks, man. Your electric bill, huh? Man. Yeah, wintertime around here, we have to be careful about our fucking, um, our power too, because it gets so cold and the heater uses a lot of electricity, obviously, but... There we go, finally. It took forever to take. Whoa, hey there. Oh yeah, these guys with the armor that has to be... Dash. This is why this comes in handy so goddamn much. I thought I dodged that. Boom! Who the hell is that? <laughs> ah, well. Ah. Oh, damn. That's one hell of a scythe, I gotta say.
Oh yeah. That's how we do. Wow, man. Look at all this. Well, let's see what we can upgrade now. I got a lot of What do you mean your bedroom's getting printed? What does that mean? <laughs> Guard crash, okay. I think we'll all go with the uh, faster dash. Wow, you can actually string that together. of blood and health level ups. Painting is uh, open now. Huh. And here we go. Oh man, things are getting serious now. Nice, there's some... I've been getting a lot of level, health level drops, but not, um... 
Not very many straight health drops. Well, once again, they're giving me tons and tons of freaking... So let's see what I can afford now. It probably would be a good idea to jump on this one. But I do love this move. It does help out a lot. I never use Spin Slash much, especially as the game progresses, so I'll hold off on that. But this and this, obviously Bullet Shot in particular is useful for a long time, and this is very useful in encounters with a lot of enemies. Um, in particular because it lifts them off the ground and can kind of give them a stun for a good little while, so... But having, if I remember correctly, it gives it a little bit more damage and it consumes a little less blood. Um, eh, I always like to get new moves in general, so we'll go ahead and get that. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Oh no, not you guys again. Man, that does a lot of damage too. Whoa! Just kamikaze? Yes, they did. I'm glad they did because I got enough roses now to. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Paint it. <laughs> Print and I, I never, uh, I never considered the typo. I was like, <laughs> "Print just sounded very confusing." <laughs> anyway, all right, let's do. Oh yeah! Whoa, we got another one of these assholes. Oh shit! Ah, here's where shit gets real. Yeah, it um it plays like like DMC a little bit, although it doesn't have nearly as 
uh, as much in the way of sword skills. Um, it's kind of more of a... Um, I wouldn't really call it a button masher because it's definitely not straight button masher, but there's a lot more like emphasis on timing and counters um, than moves and abilities. Oh, unparalleled power, huh? そんな薄着で世界を征服するつもりか下着の<笑><笑> だが断る。世界征服ゲームなんて今時流行らない。そもそもそんなゲームにしたらこのゲームのプレイヤーから苦情が来るだろう。アクションゲームだろこれ。戦うしかないってことか。それはもちろんこのゲームのためにもな。
Whoa. I'm getting really good at that dodge slash. Again. What the hell? How'd it go that way? No, 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 no. Oh, you son of a bitch. No, you bastard. Alright, asshole. Now you really pissed me off. ムーンリバー様、我が事務所始まって以来の失態です。どうもし上げれば<笑> Well, if it wasn't for that lame blunder at the end, it cost me my life. I would have freaking done even better, but... Look at that payday. Once again, another C. Damn, man. Gets demanding. Okay, man, we did an hour and 45 minutes, although I did talk for about 10 minutes before we started, so so about an hour and 35 minutes, not too bad. Four missions done. Anyway, um, well, that'll do it for this one. Um, I'm not going to rule out the uh, the potential for another stream within the next uh, 24 hours, potentially. It's very possible. I'm not sure yet, though, but uh, we'll see. I hope so. I'd really like to uh, try to get that done. Um, 
in the meantime, um, one last thing um, I'm going to mention about um, uh, something I was going to bring up at the end of the stream. Just a second. Let me, uh, let me go ahead and quit back to the title. Um, um, well, actually, two things. Um, so, number one, um, I am, um, I am going to go ahead and ask that, um, if you guys have any preferences, um, leave them down below or, uh, hit me up on PSN or, uh, on Steam, um, and catch me at, uh, Dragon Ranger on Steam, uh, also Axum Red, all one word, all lowercase, or Axum Red as well on uh, PSN, capital A and capital R. I don't know if it matters is case sensitive on PSN or not. I'm not 100 percent sure, but um, in any case, um, let me know uh, out of those four that I mentioned, which really. Three are probably more suited than others, but I'll just go ahead and throw the fourth one in there for for shits and giggles. Um, so there's um, Shadow of the Colossus, um, uh, Castlevania Rondo of Blood, and Bloodborne, and the fourth being um, Dark Souls Remastered. Um, out of those four, in particular those three, which I played more than once uh, with, Bloodborne in particular a lot and I do promise with uh, Shadow of the Colossus I will play that regardless of the vote I will be playing that soon but as far as next the next stream I do um, that is in uh, my uh, playlist um, out of those which one would you like to see next please uh, let me know. Like I said, this isn't really a voting sort of thing per se, because I'm sure not enough people are going to really um, put in a, a, a answer to really uh, constitute counting up votes. But something just to kind of point me in the direction of what generally people would like to see. I mean, for the most part, I just like to hear some kind of example, because honestly, I'm just indecisive. Um, that's the biggest problem, um, is that I just have a hard time picking uh, which game to play, and especially since I'm really way behind, not just on games for stream, but games that I'm just playing at all. I, I've re uh, recently been playing God of War, the new one. Um, it's really, really good. I love it. But at the same time, before that, I was playing um, Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, and I was really loving that game, and I'm still kind of trying to balance those out. But before that, I was also playing something else, and it's like that. You know, there's like it's like four games, right? Yeah, it's Far Cry Five. Before that, I was playing Far Cry Five. There, you know, there's so many games that I'm trying to balance, and it's just it's getting really rough. And then with the streams, it's like um, uh, it's. Um, it's like hard to figure out um, what what to do next because, like I said, a lot of times it's more reaction sort of based and it's not meant to be a complete let's play. But in some cases, like Bloodborne in particular, that was really intended to be a full playthrough let's play. And I haven't got around to doing the whole thing. I, I uh, finished after doing about 10... I think about 10 full sessions and uh, and I was getting really really far in but um and just didn't end up um finishing it. What was that? YouTube getting shut down in the UK. I oh I highly 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 doubt that. If anything UK YouTube might be um there might be changes coming to it. I know that in a lot of countries, uh, there's specific rules about what kinds of content can and can't be uh, put up. Like, uh, like in Germany, for example, there's a lot of things that have references to uh, 
Nazi uh uh, Nazi Germany and Nazi references and Nazi uh, figures that uh, are not allowed to be uh, uh, broadcast through YouTube. Um, and that, you know, depending on the country, it really depends on what, uh, uh, in a lot of uh, Islamic countries, there's certain channels altogether that are just all, uh, just flat out banned. So, um, so, you know, it, it depends, but, um, but all in all, um, I, I really highly doubt that, uh, that, that sounds like news to me that was overblown that somebody heard some and then they turned it into something else and it became something else and da da da. So anyway, um, but besides the point, so that was, uh, that was part number one as far as, uh, the game. So, uh, let me know about that. Everybody who, uh, is interested in, in my next stream, let me know. The other thing is, and this is, this might be kind of a letdown. I don't want it to be a letdown. I just want it to be something that, uh, I do responsibly. Um, I'm going to have a very major announcement, um, coming very soon. Um, we're on, we're at the 10th now of, uh, January. Um, I was planning on having this, uh, be news way sooner, but, um, certain, um, certain complications came up and, um, really honestly, I'm kind of glad it did because, uh, it's given me time to prepare a little bit more, but, um, I really, I don't want to say all the specifics yet. I don't want to give away what it is exactly I'm going to be doing. And I, I don't want to, um, I don't want to give any kind of idea as to a time frame of exactly when I will say, hopefully you will, um, hopefully you'll know what's going on, uh, within the next week or so. Um, and, uh, I can shed some more light on it, but I will say, um, that, uh, it's not, um, not related directly to transatlantic gaming, uh, at least the, uh, the, uh, group or the, uh, YouTube channel. Um, we're all still doing good. Um, Predator is doing very well on his channel. MLA is doing very well on his channel. Um, and they both have been contributing a lot to, uh, transatlantic gaming so uh i appreciate that um and it's uh it's been um there's been a lot of weird stuff going on behind the scenes a lot of people uh coming and going a lot of change of personalities a lot of um uh, strange stuff but as far as uh, the three of us go um the channel is is doing good and and we're not going anywhere all three of us have been cool as far as everything between us nothing's been a problem um there's been no problems with uh, anything other than timing uh which is kind of tough when you have two people living in the uk and one that lives on the west coast of the u.s and time frame can be kind of tough to uh figure out but um but for the most part things have been really good um but this news is more specifically to do with a project of mine and um it's going to uh it's going to sort of branch off from transatlantic gaming and i will be using it to kind of relate back to transatlantic gaming but it's going to be my own platform um where um i'm going to uh sort of be the sole uh contributor um, so, um, I want you guys to, I just wanted to let you guys know to be prepared for that because I'm really, really excited. I really wish I could tell you guys more, um, but I can't just yet because like I said, I don't want, I don't want to do this irresponsibly and I don't want things to change. I don't want any in, in, information to, uh, to, um, get uh, mixed around and then have to explain why or anything like that. I just want, um, just want to have the majority of the important details all in place by the time I am ready to make the official announcement. Um, and then once that is, once that's set, um, 
I'll let you guys know more specifics. But in the meantime, uh, I just I had to at least let you guys know there there's some uh, there's some big plans in the works, and in particular, that's another reason why I haven't been um, haven't been streaming as much as usual, uh, or as as I was before at least, is because um, a lot of my time is being devoted to not only uh, preparing for this, but um, but learning um, learning a few things about. Um, uh, in particular, I mean, I will say it's, uh, you know, it's related to um, uh, internet uh, stream streaming in some way. Um, and um, I've just got, uh, you know, this mic and this mixer and all kinds of new audio equipment. I've had to learn a lot about um about audio, uh, and that's something my brother is very familiar with because he um, was um, learning music in in college and was much more involved in music on an academic level than I was. Um, I was uh, I was more um, the the band guy, and I did take formal lessons uh, for drums in particular, but. Um, for the most part, uh, I'm, I'm more of a uh, self-taught as far as music goes, and I never really learned anything about engineering or, or um, studio recording or uh, equipment necessary for that sort of thing, or even live record, live performance, things like that. Um, but uh, I've had to um, start learning those things because uh, it's been really important to me to make sure that I have, uh, I have some great quality, uh, equipment, um, for anything and everything I might be endeavoring for, um, coming in 2019. Um, because regardless of what ends up happening, 2019 should be a very interesting year, especially for, um, for me and for, uh, MLA and Predator. Uh, basically, uh, the, people associated with the channel um should be a pretty interesting year and hopefully a very exciting one so um i'll leave you guys with that um thank you very much for watching this stream i really appreciate it always uh, appreciate it. all of our fans thank you very much for um some people must be spreading the word because our subscriber count has gone up quite a bit recently and i appreciate it thank you to everybody um, oh yeah, Resident Evil. Yeah, man, Resident Evil coming out soon, man. Um, and thank you, thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Um, and um, yeah. So anyway, thanks again to everyone who watched. I will, uh, I will be seeing you guys very soon. Uh, until then, have a good one, and I'll catch you later. Peace out.